been woeful. Hurt himself. Now it's a fake. Falls on the ground. The kicking game for Florida has been an abject disaster. Just a little better defense. Normal kick for Florida who is struggling out. Neil McKinnis, a walk-on, has a blown ACL. He'll be fine. He has a brace on. He can do no further damage so his staff until training camp. So it took a little while to get comfortable. Rudock with the fake throws to Jake Butt, his All-American tight end, and Butt has a first down. Play. <laughs> and uh, this is a good one in Jake Butt. And the good news from nice catch, just a little off. Mark goes out and gets it, running around and getting positive yardage. And he's a load at 5'11", 228. Great cut inside the 30, 25, still on his feet down to the 20. And this is against an exceptional SEC defense. Tate for the NFL is the uh, center Graham Glasgow of the Wolverine Glasgow's. There are three brothers on the team. And Glasgow, a guy who this coaching staff and Tim Drevno, who's the offensive line coach and offensive coordinator, was in San Francisco and a very good one. They think he's a second, third round pick and going to tell future guys. The co-defensive coordinators had seen enough. They decided they were going to blitz that time. Now back to the ground game with Drake Johnson. Again, was playing great at the end of last season. Nice cut behind the block of the left guard, Ben Braden. But he's an explosive guy. Who Darbo is out to the right. Single coverage with hard grades. They will go to the left. Drake Johnson. Touchdown. What a great run. I mean, just blown up at the point of attack and on the inside, but a wonderful block by the fullback, Joe Carriage. Oh. Uh, he can still hit mute occasionally. Ruda. First down and more. J.U. Chesson into Florida territory. Gain of 25. Really getting a nice feel for the game. The team's overall MVP, of course, he had the great catch at the end against Indiana to send it in overtime. And I'm, I understand why Hotball's mad. That's not necessary. Four-man rush. We're not going deep. Chesson is by himself. Somebody blew a coverage in the Florida secondary. Well, this is the side of the coverage you're going to watch. Hargraves, no reason to jump that. There's no reason to jump that. It's a rare mistake by the All-American corner, and it cost them the lead here in the Citrus Bowl. So today. Harris under pressure. Floats it for the end zone. It's up for grabs, and it's intercepted. That is another one of those awful mistakes. The backup is a transfer wide receiver and quarterback because of the of, uh, all the injuries that guys transferring. So he, everyone believes he'll do a great job at Florida. Rudolph floats it. Great catch. Flag is down at the 36 yard line. Chesson three runs sub 10 400 meters, and that's just that's good route running and a terrific throw. Blitz coming. They timed it beautifully, but they're not going to catch Wayne Johnson. Or Drake Johnson as he gets to the outside. Time this out. And he goes to the right of the center. Glasgow nails him, knocks him way off his, uh, off his target where he was trying to run through. Nice job by Glasgow, but because... The other linebacker, Davis, just ran right up into the line of scrimmage. Both linebackers took themselves out of the play. Interesting. And very unselfish. Perry is open. Boy, was he open. And it seemed to be on the side and not on the coverage. Maybe he was expecting some help and just making sure that that foot was down. And this young man, Grant Perry, a true freshman, his confidence has grown and grown and grown all year. Tailback behind carriage. And the big guy rumbles off the left side. Sione Homa. Michigan sticks with its four-man rush. And pressure again. Harris just has to chuck it. I think, I'm not sure he was out of the pocket. There's the flag. Yeah. And boy, Willie Henry has been unblockable the last two plays. Clearly did not get outside the right tackle, the so-called tackle box. Smith will go in motion. 
Rudolph shorts up that pass is tipped and then caught. Darbo makes the catch after Tabor got a fingertip on it. Just reading Rudolph's eyes, and Rudolph gets just enough air on that. And From the 49. Fake one way. Throw it over the middle to Jake Butt. So maybe some depth issues at linebacker for Ford. But still on the field as he delivered a blow. This pass is complete for another first down. Jake Butt at the 28. Would make the catch. Well, I mentioned some of those linebackers out. He's one on one with Tabor and throws him. What a route. This position. Smith again. Big hole. Good start for Florida. Just getting, you know, that right side. It was saying they were getting beaten all the this series at all. Slant pass. Almost picked, but it's a touchdown to Grant Perry. That was so close to a pick six. Marcus May read it beautifully, and it went right past him into the arms of Perry. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, May misses that by a fingernail. Chicken extends its lead as Rudock to Perry. Boy, was that close. Stretch out his legs, but once you get him in this kind of heat for a big guy, Harris will go down. They sack him back at the eight-yard line. He dissed before this ball game. And Warmly was a guy who he he. And that defensive line can now tee off on Harris. Give it to Taylor. It's a really slow developing yeah. play. That just took forever, and you knew it wasn't going to go anywhere. Send Butt back to the left. Rudolph. Chesson beats Hargraves. Runs a post, and Rudolph put it on the money for 45. Chesson has beat Hargraves. Just had the inside on him the whole way. Jake Rudolph is on the money, isn't he? Yep. There's another chance for bring him on. Third and goal, they give it to the fullback, Homa, who just bowls his way into the end zone. His fifth rushing touchdown of the season, all 242 pounds. The big senior may have put it away. They uh, transfer once again with John O'Corn transferring in from Houston eligible next season. Here's another tight end, Khalid Hill. He's not. He's Still got the headset on the glass at the end of the nose. Go, go, baby. Go, Draw play to Drake Johnson. Gets outside. Lost the ball, but it's out of bounds. Just like Harbaugh from the other guy. And Michigan's been a destination, and now you've got a dynamic guy, that head coach. Just like at Ohio State, there's a dynamic football. Third down, Rudolph. Wide open. Drake Johnson, touchdown. I love the heel flip. I've been on teams that end the season with a good win like this. It's amazing what this can do for you going into the offseason. And I know there's some questions. You're probably oops, coming back next season for both sides. They fake the punt. And they will not get it as they try to run with Taven Bryan. Sione Homa in his last game in the maze in blue. He is going to make life rough all afternoon for Matt Rowland, oh, sophomore linebacker out of Ashburn, Virginia. Wait, it's not over yet. He's going to go get him a face full of coma again oh, on the backside, and then just for the fun of it, how about a touchdown for Homa? Sound effects of Berman for those runs and blocks. Rudock over the middle to a new tight end Ian Bunting and needs to continue to put up tape against a good opponent so that's it that's why I would assume they're still throwing it Rudolph inside the 15 down to the 11 yard line thousand yard passing season which would be a big deal here at Michigan nice job of him taking off and then of course as the backup quarterback had to give all of that up blitz coming and he is drilled Well, that's just not fair if that's the way you're going to come in that Citrus Bowl trophy. Why not? I might, I might go bad eventually. <laughs> well, you just replace it. A special talent at quarterback. I think Rudock's very good as well. But Beth, a little better runner. Oh. What a snap. 
tough throw, great catch. And now the victory formation as Harbaugh is not going to try to score. Well, what a great day for the Wolverines. He goes over 3,000 yards. They win their 10th game. Quite a first year for Jim Harbaugh. 10 and 3 as he comes in to restore the glory for Michigan. On that final pass a moment ago, you became the second quarterback in the 136-year history of Michigan football to throw for 3,000 yards in a single season, young man. Congratulations. Thank you. Go celebrate. All right, thank you. Appreciate it. Mike. Doc, thanks so much. Now you can see the emotion. What a terrific ending for that young man. Final score here at the Citrus Bowl in Orlando, 41 to 7, Michigan, after taking a punch early from the Florida Gators offense, goes on to win and get their 10th victory.